What is up YouTube? A bomb here and as promised I came back with another virtual world profile for September uh, 2022. Um, this isn't the same deck as I took to regionals but I did take virtual world regionals and I got my ass kicked. So now we came back you know, and I, I, I thought I think this is the most optimal way to play virtual world. Um, without further ado let's get into it. Uh, Standard, three Lulu, um, three Gigi, two Nyan Yan. I'm not gonna go into detail on what they do because I've done it before, and if you watched it, you watched it, and they've been out long enough now, you probably already know. Uh, and then three Lalo. Uh, I thought I could play two Lili and Lalo, but it's just it's not as good as uh, having three. Cause you cycle through the deck so much and you dump so much that you can just kind of basically decide what you really want to get and then for the hand traps i got a nibiru and a ghost spell two ashes and the gamma package i'll get into this a little bit later Uh, sorry, my battery showed that it almost it's on 20%. So you cut out for a second there But for the virtual world spells and traps we got the standard two Chu Che Three Kowloon Three King Wong uh, This stuff is basically never going to change the hand traps will but the the, the What do you call it the um, the main core won't just because it's more optimal to play everything at three with this deck. And then we got three Telly, two Desires, one Goods, one Duster, and the best card in the deck right now, aside from Lulu, two Small World. A lot of people don't like this card. Uh, I have a buddy that said basically it's not, it's not that good in this deck, but I, I think it is because I, I dead ass can go into basically any monster I need. Hand traps or what have you. But, um, yeah, like, uh, and I even was playtesting against my judge with a similar list to this. It just had a couple, it had different hand traps. Um, and I, I used Small World. I activated Small World to go into... To reveal, um, I think it was Lily, and then from Lily, I bridged into Nibiru, and these both got banished face down. And then I was able to add my, I swear, uh, Lulu, because the only thing that all three of these share in common is the 600 defense. So I was able to get straight into Lulu off basically a card that I can just search out again and then a card that I might not even use depending on what deck it is that I'm playing against. On to the extra deck. I decided I wanted to make the extra deck vers extra versatile for different matchups and stuff and I wanted to be able to go into different things. So we got back at it with one Caliga. Just because if you open Crystal Wing Caliga, it's it's a hell of a board to try to get over. And then the level six package, we got the Mud Dragon, the Charge Warrior, the Coral, and the Jui Jui. Uh, they all they all put in work. That's why they're still in here. For the nines, we got Hot Red and Shin Shin because with Nyan Yan and Shin Shin you always want to go to Shin Shin so once you go into your Kaliga and stuff with your Muddy Mud I think it's a Mud, mud either Muddy Mud or Mud Dragon or the Swamp I think it's a um, it's Muddy Mud Dragon okay yeah Muddy Mud Dragon uh, and you go into your Kaliga Crystal Wing combo 
whenever your mud dragon goes to the graveyard because you fuse with it, you can banish it off your shin shin in the grave to special summon your shin shin and then add it back with nyan nyan and go for um, hot red. That way, if something happens to your crystal wing, you can get another negate out. But, of course, the classic crystal wing zoken. It's just uh, e super easy to go into and pretty strong right now. Uh, for the last synchro, we got Final Sigma. Because, honestly, right now, I play this card more than I do the crystal wing. <clears throat> if I had Utopia Beyond, I'd be playing that too. I just can't find it anywhere. Uh, I never had the card, but I, I, I can't find it. And then for the rank three and four, we got a um, a downard and a gossip shadow. I would totally be playing Gaia Charger if I could find that. Um, for the sixes, like I said, there would be a Utopia Beyond here, but Ptolemy and Fan Fan. And then we have our, our Zeus. Uh, the extra deck's pretty versatile. And then for the side deck, it's pretty simple. Uh, nine of the side deck cards are also side deck cards from my other deck, so I can just swap them over because they're the same sleeves. Um, 3D Barrier, because it's good right now. It stops fusion synchros. You know what it does. Three Evenly for them uh, hard ghost second times. And then three Dark Pillar. These are the nine cards that are the same in both side decks because I didn't... I didn't record the side deck earlier in the True Draco video because I didn't have it put together yet. And then to round off our back row hate, we got two Twin Twisters. And then we got an extra Nibiru for if we play against Combo. An extra Ghost Spell if we play against something with like heavy graveyard effects. Um, a Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit just because I can, I can, I'm pretty sure I can search into it with um, Small World. And then depending on the deck, you know, if I search into it on my turn and they go and they're trying to open up their board and I just ghost over their shit. If you if you take care of uh, the first monster or sprite summons, if they don't have another level two on board and you have more than one way to take care of a, a fucking monster, then they just can't fucking play. Um, also with the, with the hot red, you can negate their uh, sprite starter too. So uh, he's, he's a good option to go into if you don't want to go into crystalline or um not crystalline shinshin and then the last one i got a dd crow just because it's good and i can search into it uh, that about rounds it off for the profile um i'm still deciding whether i um play the true draco list or the, this list in the next locals i go to so uh, if you guys want to watch both videos that i'm putting up they should be both up by tomorrow at least uh, I don't know why, but YouTube's taken forever to post my True Draco video. So these videos kind of tie in because I'm talking about the other deck as well. But, um, yeah. You, I don't know. I, I can't put a poll up because I don't have enough subscribers. So remember, like and subscribe if you want more uh, content. But put in the comments what you think I should play. Watch both videos and then tell me which deck I should go with playing uh, this weekend. And I'll play whichever one y'all want and come back with feedback. I will try my damnedest to get at least one match recorded at Locals. Uh, but no promises. Because uh, a lot of the times I, I don't really uh, remember to carry my recording equipment. I just Right now I'm focusing on deck profiles and stuff and then getting a deck to where it can actually play. And then I'll start recording. That way I don't look like that much of a scrub. But, uh... Anyways, yeah, that's it for today, guys. I uh, appreciate the su subscribers I do have. I wanted to give a quick shout out to uh, Wiley. He's in one of my videos. He basically got me every card I needed. And also, shout out to Good Game, my local card shop in Russell, Arkansas. The uh, owners there are super cool. Uh, the owner actually traded me one of my small worlds. Wiley got me one and the owner traded me for one. I traded Wiley for the other one. Uh, but, um, yeah. And then my girlfriend for the sick play mat. Uh, I'd be playing on a Charmander mat if it wasn't for this being my Christmas present. And it's absolutely my favorite mat. So, shout out to my girl for uh, the clutch mat. 
and um, shouts out to the, uh, all the people that comment on the videos. You guys are do you guys are dope. I enjoy talking to you. So everybody that sees this, leave a comment, like, subscribe. I'm not begging for it, but if you do it, you're super cool. And uh, once I get to the 100 subscribers, I will do a giveaway, and it'll most likely be like. I'm not just gonna be like I'm gonna do a giveaway and I'm gonna give you like a, a, a card that's worth one cent. I'll probably give away a card that's like 20 bucks or something, and then uh, you know just for fun. But um, thanks for watching the vid. Uh, a bomb out. I've been waiting to say that.